Hey guys, what is up? It is Pizza Prestige and welcome back to Building Pentherophis. In this video, we're going to optimize the track design in terms of G-forces and also the excitement, nausea and fear ratings. And I must say that the fear ratings are kind of negative. Um, you know, it does end up being in the red if I'm correct. Uh, but right now we're just gonna go and send the coaster train through the entire track and make sure that everything is kind of smooth. Um, not really smooth as in smooth transitions, but as in um, banking and that kind of stuff. That there's enough banking in every single element to make it more bearable on the human body. And that's basically what this video is about. So I won't, I won't show you every single um, optimization piece that I did on this track. Just the, like the main first coverage because, well, the, the track does have to be um more smooth so i'm gonna have to smooth it out even more uh, than after this video but in this video i will show you a pov of the coaster and during the pov i will talk about another project of mine that i'm very very excited about it's um uh yeah it's great so yeah just stay tuned for that now what i want to talk about right here is this uh this coaster <laughs> last time i called it a mini hyper coaster it's not actually you know, it's not even a mecha coaster. I learned that today as well. A mecha coaster is 45 meters minimum uh, for tallness and um, a maximum of 75, if I'm correct. And this coaster is only 40 meters tall. And <laughs> you can see the little height indicator right there on the lift hill. So this coaster is kind of a mini mega coaster and it's not even really a mega coaster. So I'm not sure what to call it. Do you guys know what to call it? Go ahead and drop it, you know, <laughs> drop an answer down in the comments. I would like to know. All right, so basically the optimization is finished uh, for now. So let's go ahead and jump into one of the trains and head for a little test run around the track. So here we go, this is the POV. And right now I wanna talk about that pr project that I've been working on and I'm really excited about it. You know, I, I can't wait to tell you guys about it. It's called Irregular Facts and it's a YouTube channel based on videos that cover simple or obvious questions, well, that seem obvious, but people actually don't really know the answer to them. So if you wanna learn some cool stuff, you know, who went to space first, or why are people, you know, superstitious in the first place? Um, because you see a lot of videos about superstitions from all around the world, and I thought, you know what? Why are people superstitious? And I made a video about it. So it's on the channel. The link is in the screen right now, as well as in the description down below. So if you wanna check that channel out, uh, you know, feel free to, and if you like the content that is on that channel, go ahead and subscribe and like and all that good jazz, you know, it really motivates me to keep going and, you know, I can't wait. So I'm uploading videos every single Thursday and I hope to see you guys on that channel. So let's go ahead and go down the first drop of this coaster. You will see that this coaster does have some unsmoothness in it, you know, right here, the banking of the first Camelback Hill kind of thing. It's, it's, you know, <laughs> it's a little bit unsmooth but you know i'll do that off camera and i will when i'm finished uh, for the next video i will actually post the blueprint of this coaster on the steam workshop so that you can download the coaster and put it in your own park as an eye catcher and you can you know theme it however you want and i would love to see it so if you you know if you do decide you know i want this coaster and i'm gonna theme it or i'm gonna build something around it or i'm gonna use it in my park in some way uh let me know i would love i would love to see your guys input on this coaster so yeah i hope you guys liked this video if you did go ahead and leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already because there's going to be more content i'm not going to be able to post weekly i'm afraid uh, i will post uh, weekly on irregular effects the second channel that i own right now and um yeah i hope to see you guys there so once more you know the link is in the description down below if you're still watching this i think you will like that content as well and until then you know until i see you in the next one peace from pieces of prestige